not even 7 30 yet but i'm already here I'm currently outside because i needed some fresh air i had to change out of these scrubs <laughs> Beforehand, so we're just Hey, what's up everyone? I really should just take this down. Hey, what's up? Good morning everyone. Welcome to Vlogmas Day. I'm not exactly sure. I finally am using my tripod, which I'm super pumped about and I have high hopes for it. Right now I am on my way to work. Right now it's about 7.10. I'm gonna be like super early. I anticipated it to take at least 30 minutes, but it takes literally 18 minutes. Um, I do have time to technically get coffee, but what I did is I just warmed up my old milk tea and mixed it with some coffee. Tastes pretty good. I'm gonna drive over right now. It's gonna be a little bit of a short drive. Um, catch you up to speed later. <laughs> My freaking Disney playlist that I always had on when I was in high school because I didn't know or it's not that I didn't know it's just that I didn't bother to try and connect my Spotify but nervous for today because it's my first day on the floor so I'm getting a little bit early I'm gonna go review some things that they taught us during orientation and hopefully that helps me um, the biggest thing is just charting I know today is Sunday so I hope that today won't be too too crazy thank god everything is like flying away Calculator. Not even 7.30 yet, but I'm already here. It's really hitting me now that I'm here. I think it's kind of weird being here at 8. Obviously, the dynamic is a lot different, Um, but I'm still excited to. It's crazy because I pass by this hospital all the time, and this is the hospital that's um, that I actually go to. If you didn't already hear the story, um, I was actually needing a physical for my per diem job. So I went to my provider and I was like, okay, like I need this physical. So she goes and does my physical and she takes a listen to my heart and she's like, did you ever notice that you had a, a murmur? And I was like, no. Like I'm pretty sure if I had a murmur, I would have been told like as a kid. Um, but she was like, okay, well I'm gonna send you to do an echo. And you know, echoes can be do outpatient. So I went to um, another facility to do this. And so when I was doing my echo, the lady was like, you know what, you should try to work here. And I was like, yeah, I wish. Like I have only been a nurse for like a year and they only really need a year's experience. So that day after my echo, I looked it up and there just happened to be a bunch of opening. After that, I remember I was even applying. I was applying while I was like working out. So I was like on the treadmill walking and I was like doing my applications and I applied to like four different postings. You know, like I didn't really think anything of it, but the next day around like 10 a.m. they called me and were like, oh, can you come in tomorrow for an interview? And I was like, what? Oh, shit, like that was so fast. And so, um, I remember I went in for an interview maybe like an hour before I was supposed to work and I was really cutting it close but I remember I did the interview um, in the morning um, I went back and I was going to work and on my way to going into work they had called me already saying oh they're offering you the position which is crazy I thought that was so fast understandably so because the um, position started pretty soon but yeah, that's how I ended up with this job, which is pretty crazy. Um, so yeah, it's kind of random, um, but I had been trying to apply to this 
company since like 2018. You're not really eligible for a lot of positions until you hit your one year of acute experience. So um, that's probably why they ignored all my applications prior to this. Um, I feel like my anxiety is starting to kick in. I usually carry gum. That's pretty much going to be it for now. I'm going to go ahead and start heading inside pretty soon. And hopefully some kind soul will tell me where to go because I don't know how to clock in and I don't know how to change out of these scrubs. Yeah, that's that. But I'll see you guys probably when it's already dark. Hey, what's up? So I'm on my break right now. I am currently outside because I needed some fresh air. Um, we clocked in for lunch a little bit early. It's 11 a.m. right now. I'm just kind of getting used to their flow and how they do things around here. So for example, they use different type of tubing and stuff for their IV. Um, I like our IV sets a lot more, the ones that I used to use. They're like easier to manipulate, but that's okay. Um, I'll get used to it. Other than that, um, we also went through a lot of charting, how to send tubes. We have very, very basic patients right now, so just more so about getting your flow and catching all the routine and figuring out how to chart. Um, I still haven't figured out how to triage via ambulance, so I'm going to have to do that probably when I get back. But other than that, most of our patients come via triage, so they're very, very basic right now. Um, I am already so tired. I don't know why it's so annoying, but right now we're actually four to one, which is technically surging. Um, yeah, it's like, I don't know. I'm used to it because at our other hospital, we were always four to one and that was the standard. So I'm pretty used to it. It doesn't make me too uncomfortable, but I'm kind of sad because I wish I had three to one because, you know, that's kind of nice to have. Um, and then we're really, really short because this hospital has like 36 beds, I think, and we only have like nine nurses and we don't have a break nurse right now. And like someone from night shift is like just helping with breaks and staying overtime, but pretty crazy. Um, I also have this really disgusting fimbula here, so don't look at that. But other than that, I will update you later on. I have the salad again the salad that i always eat from trader joe's i might save it for later because i don't want to stuff myself and then i already ate a croissant and then a donut so that's probably gonna hold me down for a while i probably shouldn't have eaten so much carbs but yeah that's pretty much it for now i'm gonna be heading back inside pretty soon and i'll talk to you guys later Ugh, i got a little coffee because we have this machine But it's kind of nice drinking this hot coffee with the cold weather. It's about 3 p.m. right now. I'm on my lunch break and I don't know. It's like frustrating because um, we had four at one point and then my preceptor took over at one so that it so that I would keep the three ratio. But even then I felt like I still couldn't keep up. I don't know there's like so much to learn we still haven't gotten any ambulance runs because when i was on the floor we were on diversion which is actually really nice because my other hospital didn't have diversion oh my god you can really see my pimple ew <sighs> anyway uh we're back off of diversion so i don't know i'm so tired but i'm ready to